Gracious God, we praise you for this season of Advent, this time for rejoicing and celebration, praise and worship, exalting in your goodness. We praise you for coming in Christ, bringing in a new kingdom and anticipating an era of peace and justice when the poor have plenty, the hungry be fed and the lowly lifted up. Forgive us that we sometimes lose sight of your purpose and underestimate your greatness. Open our eyes to the breath of your love, the wonder of your mercy, and the extent of your goodness. And so we give you the worship and adoration that is due to you this and every day through Jesus Christ our Lord.
Comfort my people, says your God. Comfort them. Encourage the people of Jerusalem. Tell them they have suffered long enough and their sins are now forgiven. I have punished them in full for all their sins. A voice cries out. Prepare in the wilderness a road for the Lord. Clear the way in the desert for our God. Fill every valley, level every mountain. The hills will become a plain and the rough country will be made smooth. Then the glory of the Lord will be revealed and all mankind will see it. The Lord himself has promised this. The voice cries out. Proclaim a message. What message shall I proclaim? Proclaim that all mankind are like grass. They last no longer than wild flowers. Grass withers and flowers fade. When the Lord sends the wind blowing over them, people are no more enduring than grass. Yes, grass withers and flowers fade, but the word of our God endures forever. Jerusalem, go up on a high mountain and proclaim the good news. Call out with a loud voice, Zion, and announce the good news. Speak out and do not be afraid. Tell the towns of Judah that their God is coming. The sovereign Lord is coming to rule with power, bringing with him the people he has rescued. He will take care of his flock like a shepherd. He will carry them in his arms. He will gently lead their mothers. This, this is, is the, the word, word of the Lord. Lord. Thanks, Thanks be to God. God.